Welcome back to Sneakers on Soul Slime. was a formidable opponent. I wonder what he would have been like as my apprentice. <laughs> It's I wonder if a dragon could be captured alive. It would make a fascinating test subject. The interesting thing is that even uh, Master Naloth apparently wants Sneakers to go uh, back to mainland Skyrim now because he... Uh, we actually got a quest from Naloth. He asked Sneakers to retrieve a magical staff hidden in Morvenskar, which is on the mainland. Hello. I can get... Defeating Mirak was an impressive feat. I'm curious to see if Hermaeus Mora seeks you out because of it. Now, apparently this stuff belonged to somebody called Azra Nightwielder. And Sneakers is, of course, curious, sir. Uh, this Azra Nightwielder, who was... Who was Azra Nightwielder? He was the original Shadow Maid. Oh. His advances in magic are legendary. Shadow Mage. Less well known is that he was also a pioneer in the field of enchanting staffs. Huh. Every staff of his that I have uncovered has led me to greater understanding. Today we would consider his techniques rudimentary, but the genius is still evident. Finally, I can get back to work. Right. So, Snake is wondering whether Shadow Mage means um, like a, a night blade, like a, someone who casts stealthy magic. That would be a very great interest to Snakers. Or whether it means Dark Mage, Evil Mage, Necromancer Mage, because that Snakers does not appreciate. But he's going to catch a boat to Skyrim. And from there he's going to go to Morvenskar. I've got a feeling that my load screens actually get longer. Oh, here's the thing though. My load screens, that's why they feel longer. If you're looking for, for passage, some reason... Those messages that we get on the loading screens are completely gone, so I've got nothing to look at. That's that's odd. <laughs> Doesn't matter though; they were not really a big. Uh... Oh, really? They weren't really very interesting anymore. Those messages of Morven's got is right down here, actually. Well, Snakers was actually planning on visiting his wife first, now that he's back on the mainland. Yeah, he's... If Morvenskar is so close by, he's tempted to go just straight there, but you know what? No, he's not going to do that. He's going to go to Whiterun. No, I get the messages again. Okay, so maybe it's when going back between Solstheim or Skyrim, or what? Maybe it's. Yeah, maybe that's it. I don't know. Um. Okay. Let me guess. Someone stole your sweet roll. Yeah. What do you need, my Thane? It's pleasing to see you again. And you, Gorza. Speak. You can ask anything of me, love. Gotta love the way she says, you know, it's pleasing to see you again, as if, you know, that's kind of something out of the ordinary, which I guess it is. <laughs> this point because Nick has been to Sol's time a lot. Well, um... We've talked about Lots of things, Gorza, but maybe uh, the store has made any money in Snickers' absence. Fortune smiles on us. Here's your share, love. Ooh! <laughs> Snickers has really been away for a long time. 2,600 gold. That was good. <laughs> right. So, huh. 
No, we're not moving somewhere else. Snickers is going to move back in with you pretty soon. He promises. Conquer your enemies, my love. Thank you, that's the spirit. Also got to love the way she just says, you know, conquer your enemies and all that. No, none of that, you know. Where have you been stuff? It's just go Honor out and fight again. Methane. Now, right. I thought... Well, there's one thing I wanted to do here, and that's, um... <sighs> you may remember this, um... Mage Bane Dagger that Snickers tried to use against, uh, Ildari. It kind of didn't work. Because apparently, I mean, it's, it's designed... That was exactly the kind of situation I designed it for really fighting mages because it does both shock damage and magic damage, which ought to mess up their magic pretty quickly. But problem with it is it doesn't have enough reach. And mages tend to f want to fight the distance and so back off. So oh, that's not always the case. Of course, you've got some of them that go up against you, but I think that kind of proves that this is a lot less useful than I thought it would be. Uh, carrying a bunch of daggers with um, enchantments on them, um, but I think largely they'll be more useful like these, like against maybe melee enemies, then messing up their uh, stamina might be a good thing. I don't think this is terribly useful either. This is probably better. This is a really nice dagger, actually. This could be good too. Um, obviously, Mirax Sword does his thing. So. This mage bane dagger, I mean, it's, it's different from the others because it focuses on magical damage, but clearly it's not very useful. So I'm just. Let's see, where do I have my good weapons? Ah. Uh. Okay, I've. Right, staffs, fireballs, frost, such and that, storm wall. Maybe this is a good place to put the, the mage bane dagger. In case I do. I mean, I could just sell it, but uh, it has kind of. Alright, this is where I've kept some of the old things that I've enchanted and stuff. I think I'll put it in there instead, actually. Um, it has kind of a... ...sentimental value, because it's something that Sneak has made himself. So it's not just going to sell it. Speak. You can ask anything of me, love. Well, Snickers will ask if they wait a little bit longer because he's got a little um, job to do at Morvan's guard and then he's going back to Master Nalath. Uh, but right now, maybe he could use a few hours rest first. There we are. And Snickers and his Honor. wife have comforted each other a little bit. And now it's definitely time I to head off to Morvenskar. Your sword and your shield. Keep your sword and your shield with the Snickers' wife. Will you protect her while Snickers is away? And... We're gonna head to Morvenskar. And... Uh, I put on the... Uh, 
illusion gear because I don't know what's here. If there might be bandits, I don't want to have to kill them. If they're undead, then I'll quickly switch to something else. That sounds like bandits, alright. Invisible. Take a closer look. Let's see where. It, oh, they're not bandits. They are fire mages. Hostile fire mages. Um. Well. They are a kind of bandit or outlaw, I suppose. But Snickers would really prefer to not to have to kill all of them. Makes sense, though, that Snickers would be sent to steal, yeah, steal the stuff from these mage types. Thieving mission, then Snakes is not going to turn it into a murdering mission. Huh? What is. Oh, some. They, they seem to be fighting, but Snakes doesn't know. Mage fighting. Oh, it's this guy. Sanguine. Holy moly. Is it the Sanguine? Because Sanguine is a. Uh, Dedek Prince. 